and welcome to this week's new release video. I know this is super late. This is gonna be going up Friday evening. Um, I did update the Facebook group that I just needed a little bit longer to get these done. I just got in this custom artwork this morning, um, or actually this afternoon, so I wanted to add that on. And then last night, um, I was getting my hair done pretty much all day. And by the time I got back home, I just really didn't feel like doing test prints, listings, all of that. So it's been pushed. Um, and since everyone was so patient with me, I am going to be giving a 20% off discount code in the Facebook group, which I do keep linked down below. So let's go ahead and get into it. I've got two new collections this week and one is custom artwork. So I'm going to begin with that one. The first thing that I've got for that are the date cover add-ons as well as the glitter header add-ons. And I did not print one of these with foil. Um, I do have foil available, and there is the foil one um, for me to show for the other collection, but I was trying to get this video done. Also, Ozzy is destroying things behind me. If you guys can hear him, that's what that noise is. Always destroying something. So I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you guys in just a bit. Okay guys, so this artwork is exclusive to our shop. Um, so I've got the full boxes here and then I do also have the bottom washi that I wanted to show you guys with it So you can kind of see all of the foiling So here is your bottom washi and I'm, I apologize for the lighting as well. It's really dark outside It's been raining all day uh, So you've got these really cute Ray Dunn inspired mugs that say spring grow and bloom And then over here is your foiling and it's just these really pretty floral like leaves like a vine almost and it's super difficult to see because of the lights, but I don't think there's much I can do. It's just really dark and gloomy outside. You do have your cut washi up top and then your weekly tracker here, as well as your foiled date covers down at the bottom. And then here are your full boxes. So I love these. You've got this quote here. Let's see if we can do it this way. That says, hello spring. And this is all silver foil. You've got this milk jug here that says farmer's market flowers, fresh and local, and that is foiled as well. You've got your home sweet home rug, this really cute mason jar, and then this floral or this foil piece right here, I've been saving for the perfect kit. I love that so much. Um, over here, you've got a bunch of lavender, a lantern, as well as one of those little floral type vine deals. <laughs> I don't even know what to call it. Um, and then down here, you've got uh, the floral vines as well, just in a circle. And then you do have a scene. Um, so you've got a fireplace, you've got this buffalo plaid chair. It's got a really cute cable knit blanket in it, as well as a pillow that says farmhouse. Um, so yeah, so this kit is called Hello Spring. And I'm super excited to start doing spring kits. So yeah, I know that the lighting is not the best. I apologize. Um, I'm gonna try to get decent photos and then also I'll try to get like just some wiggles, some Viv wiggles of the foil if I'm able to. So that was the full box as well as the bottom washi sheets. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the rest of the sheets in the deluxe kit. So you've got your weekend banner, two flags, your date numbers, your cutout icons, your scripts, as well as your marquee. Your next sheet, I'm gonna have to kind of flip here. Your next sheet has your appointment labels, your quarter boxes, your, I don't know, third boxes, half boxes. These are the newer format that has all of the like glitter as well as the solid around the glitter. And then your next sheet has your little things, your headers, and then some more boxes up top. I really love the colors in this kit. So you've got a really pastel pink, minty green, or maybe like a sage green and then like a minty blue and then a little bit of a deeper green. And then your next sheet is your ombre heart checklist. You've got some flags up top and then your daily trackers. So all of that is the deluxe version of the kit. So we will have both premium matte and glossy. And then, like I said, this one is silver foiling. And I really wish I could get the foil to actually show up. Yeah, I think it's a lot of it's the glare from my lights where I'm trying to make it so you guys can see but then it makes it so that the foil is really difficult because there's no actual sunlight right now. So the next thing that I've got here is the mini kit. So you would get those same full boxes and then your second sheet here has your flags, your scripts, daily tracker, weekly tracker, bill due, heart checklist, and your cutout icons. And then your next sheet has your little things, your headers, some 
third boxes and then some labels up top. And then your next sheet has got that same bottom washi. You've got your cut washi, your half boxes, and your marquees. So all of that is the mini kit. And then we do have B6. And this, again, is the older B6 format. So you do have the smaller um, full boxes. So the box that we ended up losing, let me pull this out here, is the bo uh, box with the lavender. So just this one right here. I didn't want to lose any that actually had the foiling in it and I wanted to keep the buffalo plaids. That was kind of my only option. So you've got your seam down here at the bottom. You've got your mason jar, hello spring. Um, oh, we lost, uh-oh. We lost the really pretty banner here. I'll have to fix that before I get in to do listings. I must have accidentally deleted it while I was printing. Um, so everything else is the same. You do have three quarter boxes down at the bottom. And then you've got your labels, um, appointment labels, quarter boxes, half boxes. And then you've got a row of glitter headers, a row of var various headers, labels up top, daily tracker, weekly tracker, some flags, three heart checklist, and then your little things down at the bottom. And then for B6, I had to change the way that the washi was done. I couldn't fit the cups the way that I could on um, the larger washi. I tried it a few different ways and it just wasn't gonna happen. So instead you've got the foil florals just going in two separate directions. And then you've got your cutout icons, your scripts, your washi strips down here, and then your foiled date covers over to the side. I hate that it's not picking up the foil on this kit because it's so pretty. Okay, moving on. So the next collection that I've got is the Chris collection. So my PR guy, Chris, if you guys have ever seen him, um, he is linked on my Instagram. They, all of my PR team has like individual samplers that you guys can choose from if you wanna leave a note in the comments of your order. Anyway, so Chris wanted a boho themed kit. So this one was named after him. He did help choose some of the stuff on it and everything like that. So this is the Chris kit. So the very first thing that I've got here is the date cover add-on. And then I have got the glitter headers and these do have the foil. This is a gold foil for this kit. Same thing though, it's gonna be so difficult to see it. Um, and with this kit, you're gonna have to be able to see the full boxes. So I may have to turn the overhead light off for this one. Okay, so here are your full boxes. I love how this ended up turning out. Oh, I guess you can see the foiling a little bit better on this one. So what I ended up doing because these patterns were incredibly busy is I went ahead and made the opacity just a little bit different so that you could actually see the foil pieces that were on top of them. Um, so that's why they look kind of washed out, but that's really the only way that I could make it so you could really see this. Okay, so I'm gonna cut the overhead light off really quickly and see if that helps a bit with the foil. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, so the background might look a little bit bad, but I feel like you can see the foiling a lot better. Let me actually quickly pull out um, Hello Spring as well and just show you really quickly. And then I will cut that light back on here in just a second. There we go. Okay, so here is the foiling in Hello Spring. I'll have to remember to cut that light off. Um, and then here is your bottom washi. Okay, so back to the Chris collection. So, super fun. I love the colors in this kit. I think it's really different from anything that I've ever done. Um, and I just really like how it turned out. So I'm gonna show you guys the foiling up pretty close because there's a lot of detail in this foiling. So the first thing, the quote is, wild eyes, soft heart. Chris picked that out. And then you've got this really cute little floral with the antlers, some florals and some feathers here. I love this big cactus and then this bookshelf that has all of the succulents. Um, there's this really pretty, I'm not gonna know what to call this. I know people like hang it. Chris has some, he's shown me before. I just can't think of what this is. It's like a wall decor piece, but I can't think of what it's called. Um, and then over here, you've got this really cute bag with these sunglasses. And then for the f second, technically, a piece of foil is this feather. There we go. And you guys can see, it's like really, really super intricate, really pretty. I love how this one ended up turning out. Um, and then down here, you've got another feather that's the same way. There's a lot going on inside of it. There's some arrows, just some really pretty patterns. Down here in the middle box, you do have this girl here and she's got the teepee behind her. Um, this chair, this really cute rug. And then as you can see over here is this moon that also has like this really intricate pattern in it as well. So yeah, I really, really love how the foiling in this kit turned out. I think it looks 
absolutely stunning. So that is the full box sheet. Let me go ahead and grab the um, bottom washi slash date cover sheet so I can show it to you next to the full boxes. So that is this right here and it's two different leaves. Um, and it's this, or, I'm sorry, these two are the same but they're different from what's in the kit. And they are just facing opposite directions so that once they're in your planner, well, they would look like this laid down. So, see if I can get to the detailing. This one is really, really intricate as well. And I think it just turned out so pretty. So yeah, that is, come on camera. There we go. So those are um, the two foiled sheets together. Again, this is the deluxe kit. Um, and I'm gonna actually just continue with the lighting down. Hopefully it's not gonna look too bad. It's kind of difficult for me to tell on the viewfinder, but I can tell that you guys can see the foiling way better, so we'll keep that off. Um, okay, so moving on to the rest of the pages in the deluxe kit, I'm just gonna kind of flip through these. So you've got your date numbers, your icons, and your scripts. You've got your um, appointment labels, quarter boxes, half boxes headers and little things and I love the colors in this kit a lot. I think it's a very like unique color palette. It's really pretty like fuchsia purple, uh, forest green. I don't even know what to call this. I want to call it like an orange cream or almost a coral but with a little bit more orange in it and then this is like a mustard yellow and I think the colors all together just look really pretty. Here are your ombre heart checklist, your flags and your daily trackers and then you'd go back to the bottom washi sheet. So all of that is the deluxe kit and then we do also have it in mini and B6. So here are your full boxes for mini, so same thing. Um, your second sheet here has your scripts, your flags, your trackers, bill due, icons, and heart checklist. Your next sheet has your little things, um, your headers, some quarter boxes and labels, and then your last sheet has some half boxes, some cut washi, a couple of marquees, and then that same bottom washi here. And then for B6, and actually let me show you guys the glitter headers now that I've got the, lighting, the lighting down. There we go, okay. So you guys can see this is the newer pattern for the confetti on the glitter headers. Okay, so moving on to B6. So for B6, we ended up losing, what did we lose? I'm gonna have to look, oh, I know what it is, okay. So we ended up losing this floral box, which I did just place down here to be cut washi because I think that it would still look really nice. So you've got pretty much all the same things though. You have your quote box, you have the moon, the feathers, just super pretty. And then down here at the bottom, you do have your three glitter quarter boxes. There we go. I love this so much. Um, your next sheet has your appointment labels, your quarter boxes, half boxes, and then your third sheet has some labels, some glitter headers, various headers, a couple of trackers, flags, three heart checklists, and then your little things down at the bottom. Um, and then I was able to keep the same bottom washi or washi strips for the B6 collection. So it is the, those same feathers, they are just a, you know a little bit smaller, but it does still have all of those really intricate details, and I want, I'm gonna have to sit up on my chair here. I wanna like actually try to show, there we go, exactly how intricate this foiling is. So, so stunning. Okay, so you've got your date covers here, you've got your icons, you've got your glitter strips down at the bottom, and then you also have your scripts. So yeah. That is this week's new releases. I hope you guys love them. I am gonna work on listing these now. I'm hoping, let's see, it's 3.45. I'm thinking they'll probably be up around 5 p.m. I'm not sure if this video will be going up before or after that. Um, and again, if you want to grab that 20% off code, I will have that over in the Facebook group, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye, guys.